This is um, coarctation of the aorta part two. I'm Leslie Johnson. I'm talking about the symptoms and the treatment of coarctation of the aorta. Most of the time, the um, severe cases of the coarctation are diagnosed in infancy, um, but you're not going to see um, unless you have very distinct side effects or um, or other conditions with coarctation. You're really not going to find it um, most of the time until they're in their teens. Um, infants may have a heart murmur. If a heart murmur is present with other symptoms such as pale skin, heavy breathing, poor weight gain, poor appetite, the doctor may order um, further testing to test for coarctation. Um, other symptoms infants may have is cyanosis or mottled skin, so the skin looks really purple and, and almost bruised. Um, they will have poor appetite, poor eating, anorexia, um, sweating when they eat. Um, the blood pressure will be different between the arms, the right arm and the left arm, and it also will be higher in the arms than it will be in the legs. Um, symptoms may not become apparent until early adulthood, like 20s to 30s, when otherwise healthy adults experience hypertension, um, shortness of breath, especially with exercise. They'll have extremely cold feet, cramping and weak muscles in the legs, headaches, and nosebleeds. Um, the pulse in the legs may be really weak or delayed compared with the pulse in the arms. This is how it's discovered a lot of times in infants. Other symptoms may not occur or show up until the child is actually 10 or, 10 or 12 years old. Diagnostic testing for um, coarctation includes a chest x-ray, an EKG, um, a 2D cardiac echo, CTAs, MRAs, and um, they can actually do a heart catheterization to determine if they have coarctation. Medications and treatment um, that may be used. Um, sometimes they use medications just to control blood pressure, but it doesn't often work. Um, surgery usually has to be done to remove the narrow part of the aorta. Sometimes they have to do what is called a um, balloon angioplasty if the artery um, becomes too narrowed after surgery. Also, physicians may use a stent with metal mesh to place on a balloon catheter. It's positioned in the narrow part of the artery, usually done only in teenagers and adults. A lot of times you'll find that um, with coarctation, the um, surgery does not work. The older the patients are, the less likely the surgery is to work. That is all. Both the topic that me, Monica Cole, and Leslie Johnson chose is coarctation of the aorta. Um, coarctation of the aorta is a narrowing of the aorta, um, usually found in the descending or a between the aortic arch and the descending aorta. Um, it's usually found in eight to eleven percent of all congenital heart defects, and it's usually two to five times more likely in boys than in girls. But girls that usually have it have Turner syndrome. Um, there's really no cause for it. It's more um, congenital than it is anything. And people that have like just genes that are um, more heart defects is where you'll find it. Let's talk a little bit more about what coartation is. Coart. The nor let's talk about the normal heart. The normal heart is um, the blood is pumped through this aorta in your normal heart. This valve right here. Um, and it, it's really easy, and the blood delivers um, oxygen to the rest of your body. So when this is working, you get large amount of blood to all of your organs, to your limbs, to your arms. It's pretty much, you can get good blood flow. And it doesn't have a lot of pressure on your heart. But when you have coartation of the aorta, you have narrowing of this vessel of the aorta, which usually in return... Um, it restricts that blood and the volume of blood being pumped to the rest of the body. When you have that, that's kind of like what Leslie was, was going to talk about later on with some of the symptoms. When you restrict blood flow and nutrients from the heart that's going to the rest of your body, you um, usually get uh, the cold arms and legs and different blood pressures, which she'll talk about a little later. But um, the coartation will definitely... Um, mess with your the rest like I said the rest of your oxygen nutrients and she's going to talk about the symptoms now